me some hope And he ran off as a ghost She tried me with a stalk And a dick and a scope She said she was asleep She said take it now I'm woke Now come here bitch Oh, 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 oh Hi everyone, it's Ariel here and welcome back to another vlog. How are you guys doing? I hope you guys have been doing amazing. I have a fun upcoming week in my life, so I wanted to vlog it for you guys. Of course, I feel like my life has been a little bit boring. So as soon as this week kept getting booked and busy, I was like, I better vlog it because I have been in need of a good, fun vlog. So that is exactly what today's video is going to be. I hope you guys enjoy it. If you didn't see the little intro already, we're going to be going to Palm Springs. We're gonna be doing some fun stuff. So. Yeah, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe, and keep on watching. Hi, you guys. I'm on my way to my friend's birthday dinner, so I will see you guys there. Super excited, and I love my outfit. I'll try to show you guys in a little bit. You're telling me you're falling out of love with me. Hope you can find someone to love you better than I did. So I am so tired right now about to just go ahead. I am being careful with these lashes. These lashes are from my friend Sophie. She has a brand called Shop Glamorous Looks and they just came out with a natural collection and I have been obsessed. But anyways, it is 1.20 in the morning right now. It is Monday. I had the longest day ever. I went to the gym. I did a get ready with me on live. I took three sets of pictures. Your girl has just been doing the thing. But anyways. Let's take the rest of this makeup off and go to sleep. Also, y'all, ah, if you happen to see my armpits throughout this vlog, I'm still contemplating if I'm going to shave them or not because I want to start waxing them. And for some reason, I thought this week, the week that I have so many things going on, was the week to let it grow out. But I do think it would be funny to wax them on the end of this vlog with you guys. So I don't know. I really want to hang in there because I've never waxed them before. But anyways, good night, y'all. See you on the rest of the vlog. Hey, y'all. I am in LA. I got ready today and we have a few events and I'm excited. But first, I found my favorite coffee shop maybe ever. It's called Yeem's Coffee in Koreatown. And guys, I literally used to live four minutes from it and I never knew. So now I know and it's almost bad because now every time I'm in LA, I have to stop there. I found it on TikTok. Their iced tea and a latte with oat milk is unreal. Oh my God, someone's illegally crossing the street. I can't believe I used to live in LA and like deal with this every day. I'm running a little behind, but it's okay. I need this coffee. Like I need it. I haven't had coffee all morning because I was waiting. And honestly, my hair, I did my blowout last night and it honestly disappointed me this morning because of the way I tied it in my hair tie, but it's okay. So yeah, I'm going to get the coffee and then we're going to be on our way to Pretty Little Thing. Guys, you see this? This parking lot is always full. I'm trying to see if I'd be an asshole and be what that guy did right now. Games! It's my love for my grandmother made me gentle when I kept it. This heavenly goodness like oh my god whatever beans they use I need to know honestly it was a chaotic parking situation but it's fine um I need to have my first sip with you guys literally my favorite latte of all time and I don't say that lightly how I feel about my coffee and lattes it's a perfect color first of all whatever espresso they use is amazing like and then the Vienna cream Mmm. Mm, mm, mm. And last time I came, I got their salmon avocado toast. That was amazing. I've been dying to try their prosciutto toast. But next time, today I want to get a very specific lunch, which I'll show you guys after PLT. I am so fearful. I'm wearing all white, so I'm like trying not to get dirty but i need to start being on my way but yeah i wore this outfit in my makeup tutorial on oh, little baby 
cute um but i haven't worn it to an event or like anyone has seen me in it besides you guys so i'm wearing it again but off to plt we go i will talk to you guys when we're there i'll finish with some light makeup for the day i'm gonna take this roller out i sleep with it every night that i am not washing my hair so that i can still have my curtain bangs look fresh but i need your help to pick what outfit i should wear for today so let me change into the first option hold up so today i'm going Going for like a white vibe a white kind of look so I ordered three pieces from Zigu you can shop them at zigu.com and I have a coupon code adiel 30 for 30% off which is amazing I absolutely love their clothes they have so many versatile cute options which you guys are gonna see right now okay so this is the first option it looks so so good on I am absolutely obsessed with this this is so airy I did pick this one up in a size large just because I really wanted that airy effect and I also was thinking that I can use this as like a bathing suit cover-up as well. It has the pearl buttons. And then I love the opening. Like, hold on. I'm kind of living. So this is a halter top. Look at the back. This is so cute. Super cute option. You can even like play around, you know, tuck it in. What do we think? And last, but definitely not least, we have this white dress. I think this might be the winner for today. You see the vision? So cute and flattering. I don't know about you guys, but I think this is the winner. So <laughs> make sure to check out zigu.com. Actually, guys, perfect. Perfect timing. I just got a package in the mail and I think I know what it is. So I'm so excited. I just got this package in from Ana Luisa. They are a sustainable jewelry brand that has high quality pieces at such affordable prices. And as you can see, they come in this recyclable packaging because they are carbon neutral and climate neutral certified, which is amazing. Do you guys love them already? Because I do. And you guys, these pieces are so perfect for today's look and just every day's look, to be completely honest. Ah! I personally went ahead and ordered this three-piece set. Also, you guys, I know Mother's Day is coming up. So if you're struggling to find the moms in your life a gift this year, you cannot go wrong with Ana Luisa Jewelry. Ah, this set. I've been wanting jade jewelry for the longest time, honestly. So I'm beyond excited right now. These pieces just completely elevated my entire look. And all the pieces start at just $39, which is amazing. They're tarnish resistant, and I'm just obsessed. So you guys can use code ADIAL20, and I'll have the links down below for this as well y'all what is going on sorry i forgot perfume i want to die but i have one in my gym bag it's not something i would usually go for but it's okay we're gonna just go with it makes his rest easy get some shut up Hold don't be like me y'all oh this combo yes i wipe off the excess lip gloss with my straw even get the deal done a young gunners Taking my new bag from Artemisia Wang and then today I decided to switch it up for the IG pictures I took in this I wore white heels, but I wanted some pink heels to pop with colors super cute I don't know if you guys can see but I got the shoes on don't look at my toes though I haven't got a pedicure in so long, but Yeah, they're doing construction on Melrose. So it's kind of a struggle to find parking Have to walk a little bit, but it's okay get the steps in and yeah All these summer things. Here's the full view of the outfit. I'm like, should I try some stuff on? So I'll show you. Oh my god, like so cute. I'm definitely obsessed with this. So I'm for sure gonna get this. Jeans. Okay, this is option one. Kind of cute. I'm gonna do a reel. I have my tripod outside. So try everything on together. Next is this one. I think this one is super cute. I don't know why. I just love it. It's hella see-through though. So I love this one. I just need a bigger size in the top. That's so cute. What do we think, y'all? 
Look how cute. 1998. This was inevitable, y'all, but it's okay. Look, y'all, that's the little machine that does deliveries, I think. My little nails fell off in the dressing room, but I brought my nail glue, so. But thank you, PLT, for having me. I ended up going with that swimsuit that one set and then I really wanted the other white one but it was super season <laughs> like TMI but you could see my whole butt crack with it and it would have been cute just for a picture but I was like I want something I'll actually use so I also got a workout set so super exciting such a pretty day you guys have never been to Melrose this is like towards the end I think or like the crossover um, but I'm about to go to one of my favorite restaurants now for lunch before we hit up our next book I need to get some sandals because this is just embarrassing every time I step out the car. I need some cute, I mean I have my Gucci slides but I spilled um, nail glue on them. That's another story for another day. But yeah, I spilled nail glue on them this morning. Speaking of nail glue, I have to glue it back on my nails. But guys, this salad, I don't know if you guys have ever seen it before. I feel like a lot of people post about it. My little lettuce <laughs> ruining the aesthetic. But this is the Chinese chicken salad. Oh my god! It's a chicken salad. I love it so much. Y'all, when I tell you, it is beyond delicious. Like, beyond. So, I'm gonna smack this. I'll maybe do a little mukbang with you guys a little bit. My hair, everything's getting messed up. I kind of want to cry since I have to go to an event right now. It's fine. Shaking the dressing up. But how how is everybody? How's everybody's May? How's everybody doing? I feel like my May has been so good so far and I'm excited. Let's see. Can I do a little Kardashian mix? <laughs> but yeah, this next event that I'm going to go to is like a creator networking event. It's in Venice. It should be like 20 30 minutes away as everything is when you're in LA oh my god I haven't had this in like years like before COVID mmm so good I feel like Trisha Paytas <laughs> y'all I also picked up a setting spray from pretty little thing I'm gonna put that on but yeah I'm just gonna finish this as quickly as possible I mean I'm already gonna run into traffic so that's pretty much unavoidable usually I try to leave LA no later than like 1 or 2 to avoid traffic because traffic literally is from like 2 to 7 p.m. but it's already 2 30 and by the time I get to the event oh I forgot to tell you so what I was saying is this event is like a creator networking event it's like a newer I guess agency that put this together and it's supposed to be like a beach fest chill networking event with like food and drinks and brands are gonna be there hourglass is gonna be there which I'm super excited about so yeah I'm just excited to network with like creators and brands I don't do that as much as I used to so it's really nice to like get out there and do it more often so I'm looking forward to it I'm gonna kill a, as much time as I can there because like I said traffic's inevitable mm, 35 minutes to get there 35 minutes to go 12 miles I'm like let me finish this and head out. I'll see y'all in a little bit. Look how cute. Okay guys, so I am gonna go home now. Um, it says two hours and 34 minutes to go home. This is crazy, like where am I coming from, San Diego? It's okay, the beach is back there. It's 4.20 p.m. right now. Um, I'm trying to think of like something I could do to kill time, but either way, I would have to kill time for three hours. So I might as well, I guess, just spend three hours going home. That's my thought process right now. It was super chill. I got in and out within five minutes. I got this super cute gift bag, so thank you so much to the brands. Honestly, guys, I barely talked to anyone. I don't know, everyone was just in their own circle. Nobody really said hi or anything. So sometimes influencer events can be like that. It's like a little intimidating. You know, I'm not even gonna say too much because I don't wanna get come for. I'm so grateful that I get these opportunities and get to go to these events. But just know the culture sometimes can be a little, and who knows, maybe I come across as intimidating also so, but I'm the sweetest girl when you say hi to me. But anyways, two and a half hours to go 50 miles. Are you like, 
what so i'm gonna put my ac on i'm just gonna kick back i'm just gonna be on the phone with my mom honestly time to head home i'm not gonna get home till what is it 6 53 that's a wrap for today i will show you guys should i do it now before i head out um got this super cute set and i needed this all day and i was actually thinking about this this is from dura dry recommended by dermatologists to control excessive underarm sweating so super cool i'm gonna run through these super quick this is an invisible sunscreen mist spf 30 love that oh yay a gua sha from seishu got some toner oh a new dry brush i've been needing a new dry brush um got this cute bag from etitude oh sateen pillowcase set love it love it yes some bubble y'all know i love bubble oh honestly like a lot of sunscreens chili lime walnut yay an hourglass lipstick in the shade dove let's go on this drive at this point i might as well do a drive with me but i feel like my hair is just like not i don't know maybe i'll watch this back and be like damn girl you should have done a drive with me i'll do it another day because i'm not prepared and honestly i haven't called my mom and just chatted in a minute so let's let's go home you telling me you've fallen out of love with me Hope you can find someone to love you better than I did Taking our memories on love and treating it like nothing Taking our memories on love and treating it like gossip It's my love for my grandmother make me gentle when I care for you Tell me you're falling out of love, she's breaking my heart in two all right guys excuse my appearance but i promised you that i would try waxing on here ew i don't even feel comfortable showing this monet girl how do you do this we stand her okay anyways i've never waxed my armpits I've waxed elsewhere. I've only grown it out for a week too, so it might not be clean, but it's pretty long. Y'all, so I've been wanting to wax my armpits for the longest time. I think I already said that, but like I hate the ingrown. I don't know guys, should I let him pull it or should I pull it? I just feel like if he pulls it, it's over with. I might not even make it to the other arm. Okay, Ready? I, I decided I kind of think I want you to pull it. One, two, three. No! Holy shit. One, two, Three. It stings. It's a different kind of hurt than um ah two three ah do you see the follicles? Two three. I'm not a professional waxer, bro. Ah! Okay, I need to work on some lightning or something, but looks pretty good. It hurts now after the fact. Sunny helped me tweeze them. Um, it didn't do fully. Honestly, I'm sorry, Hydro Silk, but I don't think I would recommend it. It does the job. Maybe we're just like not doing it right, but that's what I mean. Like for beginners, I don't recommend it. But the wax is good. Um, the strips are good. Like I like the kit. I like the whole idea of it. But I just feel like warm wax, like regular wax, would have just worked so much better. So I'm gonna put some aloe on it. I am going to get ready because we are going to Palm Springs for a Celsius event, a little Celsius event festival. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna be going on live while I get ready. So yes, but I'm just gonna do my typical blowout brown smoky liner and I will check back in. And I would get ready with you guys a little bit first, but I do want to charge my vlog camera so I can take you guys along to the event. Hey guys, so as you can see, I'm already now went for some soft glam um, and now we are on the way it is taking two and a half hours to get there but it's Coachella weekend and you know multiple people are going and it's Friday so yeah we are just on the road trip now I have two outfits that I want to take pictures in on the way I want to do one with the cactus and one with I don't even know so we're gonna try to do that and then get to the fence so we can at least have like an hour and a half there it definitely should have left a lot earlier but Guys, my hair is a little messed up. No, actually, you can't even tell. We just took pictures with windmills. I wish I vlogged it for you guys. It just happened so fast. We're already running late. We pulled over on the side of the road. Windmills, the door flung open. It was so windy. I'll try to vlog the next pictures for you guys. They were fire. My hair was flying. 
but we got some good pictures guys i think i've told you before but use burst when you're taking your pictures and it will make sure to get every frame that's how you do it so that you get good pics but yeah we're like in traffic still on the way but i change into this other outfit um in case i see like a cactus or something cute flowers to take pictures with i'm assuming closer when we get there but we're here. I'm gonna go to the bars. Okay, we're gonna go look at all the booths and stuff. Look who it is. <laughs> okay, caught off guard. <laughs> so this is my outfit, guys. And this is I showed it in my last fashion haul. I got these wedges on Amazon. Don't look at my toenails, bro. The toenails. <laughs> Guys, he ha his eyes widen. That's when you know. <laughs> Yum. They thought I said Gabby instead of Addy. Y'all, I told you it's the coldest Cali has been. I feel like this might be the coldest Coachella. God. <laughs> it's really good. Mm, the fry. So I'm about to leave to LA to go to an event with Natrium Skincare and I'm so excited. So yeah, I spent my day super productive. Love the glam, love the little wing today. I took pictures at a rose farm and some other super cute pictures and then I was doing live streamings and yeah, I need to, honestly y'all, I need to make like a TikTok schedule and stick to it and stuff, but I have to get gas and stuff and I don't want to be too late. So I am going to vlog my night for you guys and today i'm so low some events don't allow plus ones and tonight is one of them so sometimes i get a little shy but i've been knowing one of the girls that works there for a really long time and i'm gonna meet her in person tonight i'm so excited so yeah i'm just gonna take you guys along with me almost like it didn't happen to make you happy you tell me Hello! Alright y'all, well, ending the night at McDonald's because I'm starving. Y'all, I need to do another fitness vlog. I know, don't kill me. I'm trying to think of like what to theme it because I feel like I'm not like a professional fitness girly. So I'm like, what do I show? And I'm too shy to record my workouts. So I'm like, mm. but yeah, I lost five pounds. So that's exciting. But anyways, I'm so exhausted. I'm probably gonna go. Sunny's gonna help me wash my car right now too. So I'm excited about that because it's dirty. T -t why uh next time speaking of being starving i decided to film myself cooking one day so this is a tuscan chicken dish that i've been making a lot and it is absolutely delicious so i just wanted to show you guys this let me know if you guys want more videos about eating and what i eat in a day and all that kind of stuff with recipes but just enjoy this little montage of me cooking dinner Falling out of love with me Hope you can find someone to love you better than I did Taking our memories on love and treating it like nothing Taking our memories on love and treating it like gossip It's my love for my grandmother make me gentle when I care for you and then again here are some other dishes that i filmed a little bit in case you guys want recipes or more info in other videos i have been just coming to love cooking so so much look how good you 
Okay, you guys, so this camera is actually dying, so I have to charge it, but perfect timing because I actually have to hop on a call with a brand, a little meeting. That's why I have some light glam on, and I feel like this is a super cute look. Yeah, I have to do some calls, clean up today, put away laundry, and then I'm going to do a live stream. I've been live streaming on another platform. If you guys want to know what it is, let me know, but I'm probably going to do that outside because it is a beautiful day today. Side note, but look how long my lashes have got. If you know, you know. Where is it? That TikTok, motherfucker, where is it? Me trying to hide my pimple. I've been using this Sugar Bear Lash Care Serum for like a month consistently. Um, I used it a little bit before that, but it's actually so good. You guys, Sunny got a new. Well, it's a new. <laughs> well, it's not his, no, it's but what is it? A 1985. It's an 85 uh, 325E Eurospec. Yeah, and they redid the paint on it. You guys should have seen how it was before. He detailed it. It looks so good. Um, he's probably going to sell it. A little flip. But like before, it was so dusty. The paint was terrible. So yeah, it's cute. Going to take a little pic with it on the ground. Just the good side only. <laughs> I just realized, I don't think I said bye in this video, guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching this vlog. I know it was filmed with a lot of fun stuff. And let me know what you guys want to see next. I definitely want to start another fitness vlog up. Some what I eat kind of content, etc. Q&As, truth or shots. Anything you want to see, let me know. And let me know what you thought of this video. Thank you guys for all the love and support always. I appreciate you guys so much. Also, let me know how you guys are doing. How you guys are feeling down below. So we can chat until I see you guys next time. Bye everyone!